Hello friends, today we are going to see how to convert a binary tree into its mirror image. So let's see what is a mirror image of a binary tree. So here is the tree and I will show you what should be the mirror image of this tree. So in any mirror image for any node in this tree the left child of the node will become its right child in the mirror image. So I will show you. So if this is the node then the left child is B. So it will become its right child. And the right child C will become its left child. Now, now you see what is the left child of B? It is D. So that will become its right child. So D will be the right child. And E will be the left child. The right child will become the left child. Then for C, the F will become the right child and G will become the left child. So this is how a tree is converted it into its mirror image. So let's see the code for that. The program is, this is the function that is mirror, the name of the function is mirror. So in this code there are three steps which are going to be executed at every node of the binary tree, given binary tree. So the root of the tree is passed and here are those three steps. I will mark them. This is the first step, second step and this is the third step. The first step is to pass the left child of the node to the mirror function that is the function itself. This means that this is a recursive function. Then the second uh, step is to pass the right subtree and the third step is to swap <coughs> the left child with the right child. So let's see how to do this. See the these three steps these three steps are going to be executed at every node. Now, now I will execute the code on this tree so that you can better understand the working of this code. See, so the first step is go to the left child. So I will go to the left child from the root. Then here, so the first step is executed. Now I came to the left child B. Here the first step is executed. So I came to the left child. Then here the first step. Now we went to the left child that is null. For D the left child is null. Means there is no left child. So when it is null this condition when it uh, when the null is passed into the mirror function. So this condition doesn't satisfy. So we directly come to the last step and we return. So we will return to the node that is D. Then this means that we came out of the first step. We came out of the first step. Now we have to go to the second step that is the right subtree. So we will now go to the second step. Now we will go to the right child. So this is also null. So we will return. First is executed. Second is executed. Now the third step. That is swap left and right child. So swapping left and right child. So we have to swap this null with this null. As there are both the child are null. So the null will be swapped. So now at this stage as both are null this is not a significant step. But now after swapping 
it will come out and it will return so now we will return to b from d so we have returned to b at b check only one is executed now we have to execute the second step so for the second step we will go to e then here the first step left child is null then second step right child is null and the third step we will swap both nulls and now we will return to b now at b check only first and second are executed the third is remaining to be executed so now we will execute the third step so what is the third step swap left and right child so we will swap d and e so e will be here and d will be here because we have swapped both childs now the third step is over so we will go back to a means we will return so now here second step so we will come to the right side so in this way the first step here so we will go to the left the first step so second and third will be executed and null will be swapped then we will return to c then it will go to g all three will be performed and we will return to c and at c second is executed now the third step third step is swapping f and g now we will swap so g and here it will be f so after swapping it will be g here and f here and finally this will the third step after the third step this will return to a and b and c will be swapped so c will be here and b will be here so in this way we have created the mirror image of this binary tree you can get the full code at github.com slash vivekanand 44 thank you hey friends please subscribe to my channel as i post algorithm videos every day and if you want a video on any particular topic then please mention in the comment below thank you